This is the 2022 Nissan Armada. As you can see, it's got a very aggressive, large stance that um, is basically good for almost anyone. Now, it's got a lot of safety features like you'd find in most Nissans, but this specific vehicle has pretty much every safety feature you can ask for, starting with the front sensors for the easy parking, um, as well as the forward emergency braking uh, with the sensor up there, as well as you have the 360 camera that starts here. You have an under each mirror, as well as in the back. Um, also, you'll see the 360 camera is right under here in the mirror. Now, this Armada has got a lot of power, okay? So as you can see by the V8 badging on the side, it's a V8 endurance engine, 5.6 liter, very big engine with 400 horsepower, as well as a seven speed automatic transmission. It gets you where you're going quickly, quickly, and even though it's large, it moves. Um, now, just because it's large and moves and has a lot of capability as a SUV of this size and class, it has a lot of luxuries that you would find on a really high-end vehicle. So um, starting with this intelligent key, you keep the key in your pocket, you press the button on the door, it unlocks the door for everyone. As well as the, the beautiful, beautiful steps here uh, to help you get in and out because it is a little bit higher off the ground. Um, now, the vehicle has been redesigned from the front to the back with the new lights, um, as well as the rear sensors. You have the back sensors as well. Um, so when it comes to parking, being in such a large vehicle, it makes it quite seamless, especially when you have family distracting you and whatnot. It's, it's, really, it's really nice to have some assistance when it comes to parking. Uh, under this little plastic piece is where your tow hitch is. So um, these families that like to have their um, four-wheelers or their jet skis, um, you can easily pull it, as well as even a boat, you could pull with the tow hitch. Now, uh, with that intelligent key, you'll be able to unlock and lock all the doors, as well as open uh, the door with the power, power uh, back door. Lots of storage space. Now, these seats do uh, go down completely uh, with just a pull of a strap. Both seats do fold down, and when they are folded down, you have ample amounts of storage space, as well as the two captain's chairs fold down as well. As you can see, I'm sitting very comfortably in this luxurious captain's chair. I, I literally feel like I'm in a private jet. Um, I have this nice, huge center console here with um, plenty of storage space, as well as cup holders, but um, it just, it just feels extremely comfortable and you can tell by the large bolster in these seats. And uh, you do have controls of the AC and you do have access to the center console up front too because there is another way to open that center console from the rear in case you don't wanna bother the driver. Uh, now, you do have some ports down here. So you have the standard 12 volt port and you do have a regular 120 volt outlet which is really helpful if you do have, um, you know, a gaming console or something like that. Now I'm gonna show you how easy it is to get to this third row. So you simply pull up on this lever and there it goes. Now you have easy access and as you can see, it's spring loaded. So it kind of stays up uh, without having to hurt someone on the entry. So as you can see, I'm not a short guy, but I'm pretty comfortable and these do recline. So once it's in the recline position, I definitely feel like I have even more space. So it's uh, got quite a bit of headroom back here and uh, ultimately I feel very comfortable. As I was saying, not only is this a very capable uh, off-road able vehicle, but it's also very luxurious. So um, it's got a lot of amenities when you're talking about memory seats, uh, 13 speaker Bose stereo, uh, one of the things I love the most is this little cubby here, which actually charges your cell phone wirelessly. So all you do is throw in your cell phone and it starts charging it. So it's that simple. And then you can take it out of the eye. 
so nobody even sees it's in there. And of course you have your USB ports. You even have a trailer sway controller here, which is really a nice feature to have standard. Uh, some vehicles you have to pay for that to be installed and it could be quite a process. But in this case, it's standard right here for your towing capable needs. So it's quite, quite beneficial. And I do wanna to touch on this uh, 12 inch display. I mean, that's the kind of display you find in most Highline luxury vehicles. And it's right there, uh, easy to see. And then of course you have the beautiful wood trim and then the beautiful stitching inside the leather. Uh, they just did such a great job on uh, making this look very luxurious and remember i said you could open that from the for the rear you could also open this from the front so both people do have uh, uh, access and then um, you do have some uh, joystick here and some menu buttons that you can control the display without having to physically uh, touch anything on the display. You can just use this if you don't like to see your fingerprints on the screen. And then of course you have adaptive cruise control, Bluetooth controls, uh, voice operated commands, uh, radio controls here. And then of course a little display up front that tells you what's working, what's not, and uh, how that goes. Of course, automatic headlights. And uh, also this vehicle does have a sunroof. So that's nice. And uh, that is uh, the interior of the Armada. So come visit our beautiful new renovated facility. Uh, it's completely up to date. We have really nice amenities from the Starbucks in the coffee machine to the flat screen TVs and the comfortable sofas. Uh, and of course, we have a wonderful, huge four story garage with probably the most amount of inventory that you'll find in any dealership in Florida, let alone the country. So please uh, feel free to select your vehicle on our website at uh, westinnissan.com. Select the vehicle you're interested in today.